Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do an eyebrow look. I've already did my brows and put concealer on my eyes. I used the crayon case brow pomade in medium brown. And I used this Wet n Wild concealer in dark cocoa. So if you want to see me try to do an eyeshadow look, stay tuned. Okay guys, so I am back. And a lot of people do their full face and do they, then they do their eyeshadows, but I'm a beginner and I'm not that good with eyeshadow. So I do my eyeshadow first in case I have like a lot of fallout or in case I look a mess and I need to wipe it all off. I want to have to wipe off my foundation and my concealer and my powder and all that. So I do eyes first. I mean, makeup, there's no way right or wrong way to do makeup. It's just... I guess however you like. But me personally, I need to do eyes first in case I be looking crazy because I'm not about to take off everything. I just be, I be stayed at home because if I take time to do everything and my eyes looking crazy and I'm my, I got to take my foundation and everything else off, don't even much worry about it, baby. I'm good. So my transition shade I'm going to start with is all of the, uh, the It's My Ray Ray palette. And I'm going to use Control Freak. And I'm just going to start putting it on my crease. So I have... Control Freak in both my creases. And the next color I'm going to use is from the Crayon Case, the Raw Sauce Palette. Um, this palette is discontinued, but I'm sure you can find it some, somewhere. Somebody still on the extra one or two or something. And I'm going to use the color right here, um, Moonlight. And I'm going to put that on top of the color in my crease just to give it a little bit more color. And I do like the little circular motion. So you can see the difference in, I just have the one color here and you can see the two that I blended here. The difference, I was lightening up. Um, they call it the build up, the build up of shadows. So that's what we're working with right now. We're trying to build, we're trying to build, we're trying to build. Okay, we're trying to build. Now that we have our two colors in our crease, we're gonna now I don't know how to do cut crease. I'm learning, but I have learned if you do put the concealer back on your lid, it helps the color that you put on your lid show more. So I'm just gonna put like a little concealer on my lid. I'm gonna take my where is it? Oh, okay, here it is. This is a um, small cream brush from the crayon case. I got it. Y'all see it, and I'm gonna use that to blend this concealer, put it all over my lid. Yeah, now I'm gonna take uh, my morph. Um, 35F palette. That's how it looks. And this uh, eyeshadow brush from e.l.f. And I'm going to use this nice little purple color right here. Let me see. What is it called? It's called Magician. And I'm going to put that on my lid. And you just pat it on so she put that concealer on there. So 
So now that I have put it on both lids, I'm going to go in one more time with the transition color that I use, Control Freak. And just fill out the top of my eye to make sure, you know, everything is A-OK. -okay. And then I'm going to take just a regular clean um, blending brush. And I'm just going to go over everything to just kind of make sure that everything is all blended together. So, you know, a wing would really be pretty, but I ain't gonna play with myself. Like, <laughs> me and wings, like, we gonna learn wings together. We gonna learn wings together. Me and wings, like, I get, out of five wings I do, I get one wing right. So, yeah, we ain't gonna, we ain't gonna play ourselves like that. But, um, okay, so we can take our tape off. Can I get the tape? And you can see it's all blended evenly. So now I'm going to go put my lashes on. Then I'll come back and do my foundation contour and highlight. Because I'm going to use a match stick today. Like, I only have four right now. Wait for my order to come in. But the Fenty match sticks, y'all, I love them. I love them. I love them. I love them. We're going to talk about that when we get to it, though. Give me a second to put my lashes on. Okay, y'all. So I'm back. I have my lashes on. And today I'm going to use uh, Maybelline Fit Foundation. I'm going to be using 350, 355 Cocoa and 356. I mean, 355 is coconut and 356 is warm coconut. I mix both of them together like a little drop on my hand. Because if I mix them together, then they my perfect color. Get a little dab of each. And I'm going to take my wet sponge. And put my foundation on. Okay, now let's get it. I got my foundation on. So now let's get into these match sticks. Now I have um only two contour right now. I mean not, I don't have any contour. I'm waiting on the contour. I have two concealers right now, and they are um suede and latte. And um this one is latte. I like it, it's really light. Cause I like to look, you know what I said, I like to look light under my eyes. Because what? I'm a highlight, oh, I'm a highlight, oh. And this is suede. It's pretty light too, but it's not as light as I would like. This is the first one that I bought. So I will still use it from time to time, but I prefer um, latte for under my eyes. And also, uh, I'm sorry, it's my baby calling me. Hold on, y'all. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> So, um, I saw everybody doing it on the videos and it really does work if you rub it on your hand a little bit to warm it up. It helps it come on a little bit easier. And this is a highlighter. Well, it's a concealer rather. So, use it to brighten up. And y'all know that I'm not, I don't have a um a steady hand so this helps me out a lot with trying to do something to this nose because baby look me trying to draw it with the other it don't work out so well so i'm gonna just blend it and it to say that it's a cream um like stick it blends really easy it's easier for me to blend this than the regular uh little as I was saying, it's easier for me to uh, blend this. Do you see how good it blends out to say that it's a, a cream um, stick? 
Rihanna just, she just know, baby. She just know. And I love her for knowing because I'm in love with her products. You see how light I am? Okay, okay, girl. And I always put like a little extra on my chin and after I'm doing it, I just go over. Some people just put it right there, but I have a heavy hand sometimes and yeah, I'm gonna stick to doing it like this. <laughs> So I finally got it, y'all. I got the um, Fenty Beauty Setting Powder. I have it in honey. Because honey is supposed to brighten. I was going to get nutmeg, but when I put it on in the store, it was just a little too dark for me. So I'm going to give me a little powder. And I'm going to sit under uh, my eyes and stuff. So I'm using a number two powder brush from the it's my Ray Ray. And you really just need a little, little bit. Like, look. And it got like a little smell to it, but I like how it smells. So. You see the difference? You see how this side looks like kind of airbrush? Then this other side that I haven't said yet. Excuse my kids in the background. Yeah, my kids back there, they having them a good time. I have two girls at home. My two girls at home with me today, Keegan and Logan, they two and three. And they're always singing and dancing. So I already set the other side. I'm going to set my chin, my forehead. And I don't, like I told y'all before, I don't bake, baby, because I don't know about all that stuff. Yeah. Now I'm going to put me a little of the contour on. I'm not going to show y'all that because I'm waiting for my contour matchsticks to come in. And when they come in, then I'll show y'all that. You know what I'm saying? So um, I put on my contour and a little blush. And I just bought this, the uh, Urban Decay um these slick spray because i'm an oily person i get oily so it's supposed to be really good they say this and the uh all nighter spray are really good so i'm gonna set my face with that and i'm a highlight oh i'm a highlight oh so the matchsticks are also um highlighters they have highlight shades to the shimmering I have cinnamon, but I have fell in love with tripping. So that's what we're gonna use today. This is tripping. Look how pretty that is, y'all. It is so pretty. And you can just rub it on your face, but I put it on my hand too. Look at that. Look how pretty it is. This is it. This is the latte from early what I used as a concealer. But this is tripping. That ain't that pretty. So I'm just gonna roll it like that. And I'm gonna give me a brush. And I'm gonna using um this brush from it's my Ray Ray. And I'm just gonna get some of the tripping off of my hand and put it on me you can see it's real subtle but I until I get more comfortable with it I'd rather put it on with my brush and work my way up because I rolled it on my face one time and child <laughs> I overdid it and I mean I'm sure you can wear these alone, but because I love highlight, I always just, this is like a base for my other highlighter for me. But it's really, really pretty. Let me just put it on my, so y'all can see it good. You see it? How pretty that is? You can just blend it down into your, your contour. And I'm definitely going to put it on my nose. I love this. Work with that. Ain't that pretty? Look at that. That's pretty. 
And I am going to put a little bit on my Cupid's bow area. See, just blend it out. And then I'm going to also use... Um, what side is this? The Moscow Mew. Oop. My bad. Uh, this is also Fenty Beauty Highlighters. I'm going to use the Moscow Mule on this side. Uh, and it's really pretty too. I like it. You know, we got to make our C like Rihanna girls. And just put that right on top of the trip and on my cheek. Make my little C. Add it on the bridge. And I'm also going to get a little small brush. Small brushes. Y'all have so many brushes. I showed I showed y'all how many small brushes I got, but here I found one. And I'm gonna take a little bit of it and put it in my crease. Well, not my crease, but like the corner of my eye. Just a little bit. Give me a little you know, bang bang. Okay, next I'm gonna just go ahead and line my eyes. And I love this. This is the gel I pencil is from LMA. I got this from the I don't think I got it from Walmart. Okay, for my lip, I'm gonna use Bear from the Crayon Case and Marie for a nice little nude lip. Um, y'all. When you wear liquid lipsticks, your lips cannot be like chapped, dry, no kind of way. This exfoliator from ELF, it works wonders. Exfoliate your lips, ladies. Exfoliate your lips. It helps your lipstick lay better and it looks better. So. And this dries really, really fast, so you have to be ready. And here's my finished look, ladies. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up and turn on your notifications. Wait for my next one. Bye, baby child.